Hello everyone and welcome to another new video. Today I'm going to show you how to move around the uh, Tron wallet and uh, the various features, the various options available in the Tron wallet. Now, before I can move ahead with the, with the details, I would request you to kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel if you have not done yet and please do not forget to press the bell icon. So Tron wallet is a you know multiple token wallet. You can besides Tron, you can hold uh, you know multiple cryptocurrencies over here. You can see there are lots of uh, cryptocurrencies we can which you can hold. And on the top of the screen, you can find the current value of TRX, which is zero point zero one nine Ethereum. And in the drop down, you can have the various uh, accounts which is there right now. The default account is wrong so if i select ethereum and i select a main account okay i'm going to get ethereum over here likewise i can go back and select a btc account bitcoin and select this so i'm going to have bitcoin over here you can see the send receive the scan options for the respective wallets and above on top of the screen a screen sorry you can see the current value in usd then I would go straight away to the Tron section because that is what most people are interested into. So let's go to the Tron, select the main account. And uh, for people who have been using Tron, I mean the Trust Wallet most, is the one of the most popular browsers. So I'm going to compare that with uh, this thing over here. So you can create here in the top right corner, you can see there is a plus sign over here. So what you can do is you can create multiple accounts. You can restore your account or you can import with the private key or you can just have a watch mode account wherein no transactions are done so when you create an account it's like creating a fresh account so if you're creating an account make sure that you do not reveal your secret phrase to anyone you write it safe at two three places because in an event you lose that you're going to lose your your amount your money your tokens forever the restore account is if you want to restore it over here likewise you can import with your private key over here so you can see over here there is one two i have had already around four accounts over here and it's easy to change between that and let's stick to the main account over here this is the copy option now this is if you want to receive trx you can also get the same address you can see here it's uh address is th and ends with gj so let's go to receive you can see the qr code opening up starts with th and gj so is a share option is there if you want to share it with someone to receive trx then you have this is your send option if you want to send you can punch in the number of uh yeah like the number of trx you want to send and uh when you click next here you input the address whom you want to send and you can send it across so let's come back then you have a freeze option i'm not quite clear what exactly it is there's a words and scan and things lots of things over there I am trying to go with the popular options. Now here you can see uh, the tokens which are there below, below. and uh, the plus sign we have seen the notification is for any uh, particular news coming up like they have a, a clever white paper and uh, you have some stuff coming up. It's not got to do with immediately like your token credit notification or stuff like that. And uh, in the bottom menu you can see at the left hand side of the screen is the browser. Now, when you hit the browser, you can enter over here, like, for example, the current uh, program what I'm working on, Forces Tron. So, I'll just try to go over there and show you a demo of how things look when you're working on the browser. So, if you can see over here, you can go into the viewing mode. I'll just uh, punch in here, 309, viewing mode. So you see, this is my current uh, Forces Tron uh, program which I'm doing. So this is the browser. So if I want to come out from that, I go to the center of the screen and I come out and at the browser at the extreme right, you have the cross mark, which when you do, you're going to be taken out from the browser and you're going to come to the main balance. Now, the second uh, icon from the left is the portfolio. Now, this portfolio can include multiple cryptocurrencies here in the settings section you can go and select whichever you want i have selected bitcoin trx and 
Ethereum. So it's going to give you a com uh, compiled uh, portfolio with the current portfolio value. And you can see it's a summary of all the accounts what you're holding. So right now my portfolio value as you can see is worth $1.1512 uh, and it mainly constitutes of TRX tokens. Now here in the center section is the wallet. So if you are uh, supposing you are in the browser or any other option, if you come to the center, you're going to be taken to the main wallet. Now the second option from the uh, right is the swap auction. I've done a separate video uh, showing it but just I'll try to get in fast <clears throat> this is an option wherein you can swap your TRX to Bitcoin uh, TRX to Ethereum or vice versa you just put in the number or the quantity what you want and it would show you approximately what would be the value you can do the swap over here right within the Tron wallet and at the extreme right which is there you have the settings which is there the address book you can rename your address book you can filter out the tokens you have a backup of your wallet therein supposing you've forgotten your secret key you can go over here and get your secret key and uh, you can see here right now there's a highlighted always ask a pin now this is your secret pin you know whenever you, the wallet pops up or supposing you want to open your wallet it asks for a pin it is advisable that you always keep this pin on because in an event, uh, you know, someone else is using a mobile, they wouldn't be able to log in or peep in into your uh, Tron Wallet account. Then you have the language option and their social media profiles. So, in short, uh, this is how the basically the Tron Wallet uh, works and the interface is quite uh, a breeze, I can tell you. And uh, one thing I forgot to show is at the right of the tokens are the transactions. So you can see all your transactions over here. The recent transaction, you see the smart contracts and uh, the transfers done over here, like 705, uh, this thing has been done. So when I click here, over here, you can get the details of the transactions whom it has been sent. You have the transaction hash over here and the details over here, when and what it has been sent. So with this, I think I've covered almost all the aspects of the Tron wallet and I'm sure uh, that has clarified a lot of, uh, and maybe I've uh, clarified a lot of stuff and uh, created, I mean, cleaned a lot of uh, cobwebs, if at all, uh, with your people who couldn't understand that. And uh, with this, I would like to conclude this video. And uh, before I can conclude it, I would say that, you know, you can find the link for downloading this particular wallet in the description section as well as the comment section and uh, before i can end this video i would request you to kindly like subscribe do not forget to press the bell icon please do share it with your friends family so that more and more people can be aware of various options wherein they can store their crypto port uh, cryptos safely and securely and uh, before I can uh, end this video, a, a short uh, reminder that the Telegram group and the WhatsApp link, what you're going to find below are the links to my Ethereum smart contract, wherein I do reviews and uh, the latest pre-launches, info on pre-launch, the uh, launch dates, the, you know, any specific uh, news, and most importantly, the link first. So you don't need to join 50 groups to get this info. You can get all this info in one single group. So don't miss to join that. And uh, with this, I come to the end and I would like to conclude it over here. Please take care of yourself and be safe.